Wavelet Compression As we have discussed in previous videos, there are several recording modes available in Brainwave 4. If we launch a recording of raw data, this data can end up taking a lot of disk space, about 8GB per minute. To save space on your drive, Brainwave 4 offers two compression modes. Going to the Controls panel and clicking the Settings icon will launch the window. Currently, we are in the default recording mode, the raw data mode. By clicking and going to Compressed, we can see that the recording channel has opened, from the Biocam to Channel Validation to Compression, and then ultimately the exported BRW file. By clicking the compression box here, we can select between the two compression modes, denoise blinking, which we have discussed in a previous video, and wavelet compression. Unlike the noise blinking mode, which records only detected events like spikes, the wavelet compression records all the channels during the whole period of time, and it is the built-in Brainwave 4 algorithm that compresses each wavelet. Here we can choose the compression level, and we can see the estimated space saved. Moving to a lower level will reduce the space saved, while moving to a higher level will increase the space saved. Once we have selected our compression level and are satisfied with the space saved, we can click OK. Now our recording mode will automatically change to the compressed mode. We can preview our data by clicking play. And see that our channels are acquiring data. Click record to begin recording. Now when we open our file, now opening our file and selecting some channels, we can see that the data has been recorded. Again, data has been recorded on all of the channels through the whole duration of our time period.